Even the rich and famous get fed up sometimes. It's understandable when stars get annoyed with paparazzi in their faces or self-requests, but you'd think they'd be a bit more patient when it comes to their fans. Here are 20 celebrities who have let their lofty status get to their heads and are known for being downright mean in person. Yeah, a few tweets who have interacted with celebrities and lived to tell the said tale. It was not me even wanting a picture. It was a kid. She had lost her mom a few months back and I took them to McDonald's. I asked that when he's done, can the little fan take a picture with him? He acted like I asked for his wallet. Kid didn't even get a hug or a conversation. We met Tembi in Thailand. Girl was so rude. You know meeting fellow countrymates in another country. Yo, she was so mean. Kelly Kumalo. Five years later, I finally get to talk about how rude Kelly Kumalo was to me. I remember rushing to the bathroom to cry. My then boyfriend got me a VIP ticket specifically so I could meet this woman who made me feel like an end. Robi Malinga stepped in and gave me a hug and a conversation. Two fans who met Andile Jali had this to say. Andile made fun of me in front of his fellow teammates in 2010 when I was a waiter. The pieces of shit he was with laughed along with him. Yes, as disgusting human being. He's good at what he does. Great soccer player, but he is rubbish. Sinande Mfenyana once went to the VNA waterfront in Cape Town and demanded that Edgar's closes because she didn't want to be mixed in a crowd. She waited for her guts to come pick her up and they covered her with a towel. It was a movie. Well, people still refuse to forgive her for insulting that supportive woman woman during a pregnancy and mising that cashier. Lira is another repeat offender. Lira can't speak to people's shame. I once asked for a picture and Lira said black people act like they care but they don't even buy our music. Hi bo. That one before she blew up embarrassed me at a family gathering. I just wanted to tell her how much I love the trick she did with Zombo. I didn't even bother to ask what connection she had with the family. Tando Tabete. It's Tando Tabete for me. We went to the same event so I asked for a picture and she told me to follow her all the way to where her boyfriend Franz Marshall was sitting so we could take the picture. When we got there she then ignored me and hugged and kissed her boyfriend and finally told me she was still busy. I have never felt so humiliated in my life. But when I heard that they broke off their engagement with the boyfriend, I was like, good shot, saves the right. Tando Tabete strikes again. We were at in July with friends. I went to the toilet. She took my seat and told my friend that I would have to find another seat. I came back and removed it and sat down. I can't will all pay to sit in that marquee. Celebrity card is insufficient. She is rude, unkind and just not a nice person. When in Chaba, I met her in 2008 when I was in grade 6, a bunch of us school kids saw her sitting with Palisa M in a coffee shop and we walked up to them and greeted them and asked to take a picture with them. Ketiwa told us to footsteak, I was so hurt and yo, that woman is worse. Ask everyone from Clearwater, Shubens Valley and Allen's shop, Bakala Ngai, she is super rude that woman, she is very rude. I remember working as a security guard in one of the estates in four ways. We were using a certain application for access control only to find out that her name wasn't on the guest list. She demanded an entry forcefully even though I explained how things work in order to get in. KO. KO for me, I greeted him and he looked like I had pooped myself. This one from Tiergast the yellow bone, yo I can't even remember his name. My 10 year old daughter greeted him, he didn't respond, he just looked at her. Then she said to him all I wanted was a picture. My daughter doesn't even like any of his music anymore. Sitlendaba. I once met Sitlendaba at the airport at Woolworths and asked for a picture. Back in her Uzalo days, she didn't even smile. She looked at me up and down with disgust. She turned around and started laughing and smiling with the security guard at the door. From that day onwards, I said no more celebrities. Cubs are the small cubs. I was a DJ at my brother's function last year. How people wanted to take pictures but he ignored everyone and just got on stage. Even my mother commented on his cold and bad attitude. Ukabza also likes to swear at fans, especially girls. Another one says, Ukabza what I mustn't stand next to him because I make him look like a dwarf. Vom Gondole, you she doesn't mind telling you that go away for sec. So around town Toyando and I decided to greet her way I didn't recover from that since 2014. Katleho Danke, she was attending a work function at Protea Hotel Midrand, where it seems she stayed overnight. The staff wanted to take pictures with her and she rudely said no. And that time she had left the iPad co reception and had to humble herself and ask the same person to help her find it. This is not the first time anyone had said something about Katleho Danke. Years ago, the crew at Generation claimed that she would only greet actors and actresses who she thought were on a level and ignored the rest of the crew. Zizo Peter, now nah, I'll never forget how Zizo Peter passed me by in SABC parking lot when I was asking for directions for some studio I needed to find as I quote her exact words, I don't have time for you. Zizo you, I love the shame, never meet your idols. DJ Cleo, I'm so glad I learned to never talk to these people. Years ago, my friend said hi to DJ Cleo. He responded by, don't even come close. I vowed to never say hi to a celebrity in my life again. So, Mizi, 
Listen, I work with most of these people. Greeting them in the corridor and not being acknowledged is rude. It's not like I'm asking to take a picture with you. No, I'm just being polite and greeting you. They just ignore you and continue like nothing happened. DJ Zintli, I'm saying nothing bad about DJ Zintli. All I'm saying is that my experience with her was horrible. My cousin asked for a picture in Swaziland at a hotel and she was very rude, uttered some rude words and ran off. Another says, I was once a waitress and served her with AKA. She was so rude but AKA was so humble. He called me ma'am the whole time. I once met him at King Ushaka International Airport at a restaurant. He was eating and just said hi. Before I could even say anything, he dismissed me so rudely. Now even if I see a celebrity, I won't look twice. Tulipi. Tulipa Ngolo thinks she farts a perfume. We used to sell books at UJ in 2015. She was a student too. Obvious, she was a celebrity, so people would try and greet her. She would walk away like she didn't see anyone. I don't hate the girl. She can act. I think she's hot. Mara, her attitude, I give her 1 over 100. Zex Pantini. Zex Pantini was so rude to me in 2014 at the Hansa Festival of Legends held in Newtown. But he's my favorite at the moment. I realized I overreacted and I don't know him like that.